welcome back to another video today is one of the biggest uh, days for the white panda and I'm glad I'm here to record this um, I didn't show you a little bit of the stuff but I went out to go borrow a trailer big shout outs to Tom I appreciate you letting me the trailer I had to go buy a trailer adapter for my truck to the trailer as well I uh, picked it up at O'Reilly's. O'Reilly's is always having some good stuff. So if you're ever looking for parts or something like that, O'Reilly's trailer stuff, I mean, luckily they had it. So truck is full of gas, trailer is taken care of. So now it's time to get the white panda onto the trailer. I might have to change because I just got home from the gym. So you're like, damn, this guy's always in shorts. It's because I'm usually uh, just leaving the gym or just getting, sorry, just getting back from the gym. But let's get the white car on the trailer. an issue I pushed the car all the way to the front which typically that's what you want to do to carry all the weight to the front of the trailer but this is a, a dual axle trailer so I think if I what happened was let me tell you why I wasn't getting enough clearance because of the drop uh, my buddy let me use this and I don't have the, the sockets to remove those to kind of bring it up higher but this uh, when the car was all the way to the front this pretty much was literally like that close to the ground so at least I got another th two to no, about three inches off the ground more because I put the vehicle in the center of the, the trailer. So I, uh, I loosened up the front so that I could get the car back. It's pretty pretty to the level to the to the middle of the of the trailer. So now I'm just gonna put these tie these down and then get on the road on my way to Rob Fab. One thing I like doing is using the zip ties to tighten the, the excess strap back down because they tend to flap around so you don't want to be flapping around so I usually zip tie them onto the to the excess so that, sorry there you go I zip tie them so that they're not flapping around so we'll just go ahead and do something like this boom put a zip tie to it should hold it in place while we travel looks looks clean we'll do the other side This one is this way, so we'll just go ahead and do it here. Do something like that. It's just the little things that, that are important. Uh, attention to detail, just like the bagging and tagging the bolts. Um, if, you, if you learn how to do this stuff now, uh, in the long run, um, you, you'll learn to win and patience so now it looks good it shouldn't flap around we'll just make sure it's tight obviously bring some some cutters just to, so we could cut it 
later down the road. And I'll go ahead and do the front ones, but that's uh, we gotta get on the road. All right, good to go. Change, showered on my way to Roth Fab with the car in the back. And <laughs> this is crazy. I'll share with you guys. Uh, we'll see. I'll try to share as much as possible without giving it away. Obviously, this is gonna be a reveal for SEMA, so I'm gonna give you guys a glimpse of what's going on, but it, on my way to Rafa, it's about an hour and 45 minutes up to Riverside County, and yeah, Riverside County, see you then. So we got here oh, about an hour and 45 minutes or so, maybe two hours, I don't even know. But it's still on the trailer, so that's a good thing. Dude, stop following me. <laughs> this guy. What up? Right, I, can we show that yet? I don't know. It'll, it'll release like in two weeks. So. In two weeks? Okay, I'm not going to remove my hair from there. <laughs> What's up, Sam? What's up? What's going on? How are you doing? Good. Good. So, this, dropping off the car here at Sam's. This is the beast. Yeah. Did a little bit of work at it yesterday, removed the rear rear bumper. Oh, okay. Just try to take as much as possible as out. Yeah. Sweet. I brought the dash just, uh, just in case. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use that particular dash. Mm -hmm. uh, Cause some of the tats, they're real brittle. Mm -hmm. So I, some other guy's gonna give me another one. Oh, sweet. But at least we have an idea if, if we need to kind of figure out where it needs to go. Yeah, no problem. Uh, no door panels. I mean, unless you need some, I could probably get some. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I'll need them. But yeah, yeah. Let's, uh, let's unload her and get her in. Cool. Alright guys, so the car is going to stay here and Sam is going to do his magic. I'm going to try to give you guys some stuff, but for the most part, you guys are going to have to wait till SEMA. But this will car stay here for a couple weeks. And I mean, so stay tuned, bear with me. There might not be as many videos, but there's still movement, there's still action going on. So I appreciate it watching. Subscribe, hit a thumbs up, and make sure to pick up some merch and stuff like that because then I... I'm, I'm gonna be able to pay for this thing because it's getting expensive. So buy some t-shirts, some stickers and stuff like that. So I'll see you guys on the next video.
Oh,